how to celebrate Rosh Hashanah. Rosh Hashanah, known as the Jewish New Year, begins the Jewish High Holidays, a time of reflection, charity, and new beginnings in the Hebrew calendar. Here's how to celebrate it. You will need a dinner, two candles and candlesticks, kosher wine, a large round challah bread, sliced apples, honey, and a flowing body of water. Step one, clear your schedule. Rosh Hashanah falls on a different day each year, usually in September. The two-day celebration starts at sundown, the evening before the first full day. Step two, start the holiday with a family dinner on the first night. The meal may include gefilte fish, matzo ball soup, roast chicken or brisket, carrot simis, and pomegranate. Greet everyone by saying Leshana Tova, which in Hebrew means for a good year. Step three, light the candles and say the ritual blessings over them. Recite the Kiddush, or blessing over the wine, and the blessing over the challah bread. Pass the challah around for everyone to break off a piece and dip the bread in slices of apples in honey in the hope that the new year will be sweet. The circular shape of the challah bread represents the cycle of the year and of life. Step four, go to temple. Most synagogues have an all-day program that includes songs, prayers, readings, sermons, and the story of the binding of Isaac from the Torah. One of the holiday's mitzvot, or commandments, is to hear the ram's horn, or shofar, which serves as a call to examine your behavior. Step five, after services, follow the rabbi to a flowing body of water for a ritual known as tashlich. Some tashlich ceremonies include tossing bits of bread into the water to symbolize letting go of your sins. Step six, reflect on the past year and the year to come. Take time to remember the less fortunate and include charitable giving in your Rosh Hashanah celebrations. Did you know in the Bible, Rosh Hashanah is referred to as Yom Hazikaron, Day of Remembrance, or Yom Trura, Day of Shofar Blowing.